the new Microsoft RDS app for the iPad. Really cool. If I click on that, it takes you straight into my uh, set of machines. Go straight onto connecting to a Windows 7 machine. Shouldn't take too long to load. All from the iPad. Got the choice of mouse moving. We can actually go with touch. Um, do what you want to do. Let's put it back on the mouse pointer. This machine's only got 512 of RAM, the actual Windows machine. There you go, seems to work alright. You can come out of it, leave this session running, and we can try as a Windows 8 machine as well. It's just loading the antivirus, so you'll probably see that in a second. There you go, straight onto the Windows 8 machine, which is happens to be loading the antivirus at the moment. Come out of that one. Uh, up here. And now I'm going to try one of the actual virtual applications, which is on the host server. So let's just try. Let's see if we can run. Oh, that didn't run then. Bit of word. That seems to run alright. Um, into Chrome. And it comes up. There you go. Uh, Explorer. From this, uh, obviously, you can open up any other app because we haven't restricted it in any way. Do, 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 do. There you go, straight into your machine. You can actually go onto the desktop of the host machine and you can pick any other app from that. So, not VNC and connect to something else. 